Hello. Okay. What's up? What's, What's up, up Mike? Mike? How you doing? Mike Racine here in the studio and Thanks his dog. dog. What's Hello. Yeah. This dog is very uh very nice dog. How old is this Thanks. dog? He's 6. 6. Can we yeah, get him up on the But I appreciate you letting me. Frankie. Come here. Come here. Let's see if we can pop him up here. Come here. Come here. People would love this dog. Yeah, yeah. this is a very nice this dog. This is one of those dogs. Oh, he was um <laughs> wow. <laughs> For a while, my Instagram explore page was all dogs like this and Asian babies. Oh, <laughs> yeah? Yeah, I thought that I was a pregnant lady for this some This is time. him. This is Frankie. Wow. Look at this that fucking dog, man. Sharp head. Is pug. this the... No, this is the second dog on the show. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I thought that we've never the first had a dog one was, on the show. Um, it was Joe's dog. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was going to say, I was trying to think of a somebody that we know that I can oh, say. Yeah. <laughs> who's that dog I'm not, I'm not quick enough hmm. who's somebody that we both know though? who's I mean, a complete yeah. dog yeah uh, oh did you guys have no that's not even well you met my wife <laughs> no I'm kidding no 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 no, no, no. my wife's um, she's not very ugly I was just saying that I saw I saw a picture of a like a painting of a pug from the 1800s that mm-hmm. uh, came up on Twitter and it was a no, it was a normal dog. It was yeah. before they fucked up. When you say up. normal yeah. dog though, what is it, you wouldn't you would not be able like to a guess snout it was a, and a, shit? A, yeah, you would not be able to guess it was a pug. It was just just a, a dog with like kind of like a downturned mouth. Yeah. Oh, and a I guess frowning it, dog. It and that just was took it. 200 years for them to fully so he, do it. So he's a Sharpe and a pug, mm-hmm. but he's not half and half. He's like 3 quarters Sharpe and quarter uh, pug. Okay, so, so somebody just, bred him with it, like they already mixed. They already had a weird mix. Oh, and then oh. they just fucking yeah. yeah interesting. That, that's a kind of dog. And his dad is the pug, so his dad was really small. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the, the holding up <laughs> yeah. thing. Yeah. yeah, yeah. There is so him a many special chair. When you start th- <laughs> when you start <laughs> thinking about how many of the dog breeds that are popular are made, yeah, it does not paint a very pretty picture. Oh, man. absolutely no. not. My yeah. dog is a is a. Uh, German Shepherd and a Corgi mix, and okay. I believe the German Shepherd was the dad. So this is a bad situation in the opposite way. I okay. think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where right. that German Shepherd, where it probably the, wasn't consensual. Probably for the not. Yeah. It probably yeah. was. Yeah, I mean, dog sex. I don't know. Is uh, <laughs> <laughs> like two minutes that in. consensual <laughs> yeah. anyway? We're getting, we're getting normally. Right <laughs> It's <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Yeah, I just don't, I don't care. Yeah, I don't care about my that. ex's oh, yeah. parents had a Pomsky, which is like the logistics of that don't make any What's fucking that sense. That's a Pomeranian Husky. Uh-huh. Ew. Yeah. yeah. Ew. That's crazy. Yeah, that's that disgusting. One's I was yeah. just I was thinking Terrifying about like I mean the two hundred years to fuck up a pug. Can you imagine being like you're you are just a really ugly guy. You're so so ugly, and you see a picture of your ancestor, and they're like so fucking hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 What the fuck? I think people yeah. are experiencing that, right? Yeah. Isn't yeah. that the whole? The, a lot of people always talk about like people used to look older. Yeah. yeah like yeah. people would be twenty one, and they look they had like fucking beautiful yeah, in the 70s. faces and shit. Like yeah. all the people in Greece, the yeah. movie. Where it's like, oh, these are supposed to be yeah. high schoolers. Guys look right. like Charles Bronson. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, not anymore, really. No, you don't no. Know that. sometimes I will learn that somebody is over thirty, and it sends like a shock down my spine because <laughs> they look younger than me. Yeah, and that's always very scary. But also, I'm bald. Yeah, which, yeah. which is not. We do look old me. for our age. Well, you've always no, I don't looked think so. old. You don't think he? Lo- How old do you think he looks? Well, he's probably like in his. Late twenties, yeah. Well, he's 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 yeah. hit the nail on the head. Well, I think I knew that already. But, uh, yeah, but you look cheating. you look fine is the point. Okay, I've always looked older. <laughs> you wanna, I think yeah. when I was sixteen, I, I looked the exact same. So I think I've grown into my face. Mm. Well, but, you have a fucking your your beard grows up to your eyeballs. Which that's is true. A very scary. Yeah, I have to shave that thing. All I don't the time. like that at all. No, and it does make you look older. Oh yeah, yeah. I have a Wolfman syndrome or and something. Like a, a cartoon. Yeah, like a Bob's yeah. Burgers not character. even human. Yeah, I yeah. would say. So I look like a cartoon, is what you're saying? Yeah, that's exactly what I said. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you right. do look like a cartoon. I said you look like a cartoon. You said so. I look like a cartoon. That's what you're you saying. You said a specific character. I said cartoon, and then I said Bob's Burgers. Okay. No, he sounds like Bob's Burgers. He does sound like Bob's Burgers. I guess I'm. I guess I'm the most cartoonish out of the, all three of us. That's easy. Well, yeah, yeah. You, I have maybe given you a little bit of competition, but you have mm. big eyes. 
and uh, I'd be easy to draw. Is, I, I don't think that's a that's a terrible thing to say. It's not bad to be cartoony. You have no. like a Mission Impossible a, two mask on mm-hmm. type of like thickness <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> to your head. <laughs> it does look like it would be ripped off at any point in time. You have a yeah. normal skull under there, but it's there's no way it's a fish. normal skull under there. That thing is massive. No, you will be confused. You will be confusing a lot of archaeologists in 10,000 yeah. years, I think. <laughs> There's going to be like a dent I don't know about yeah, in my right. skull. <laughs> you definitely have a second. Have you guys ever gotten scared that you had a uh, a twin that you ate in the womb? No. Mm-hmm. Scott Chaplin had, like, had really? that. Really? But I think you would know if you did, right? Scott had that? Yeah, he well, I always well, maybe your parents would keep it a secret. I don't, oh, I've, yeah, all, yeah, I've yeah. always been scared that I have some kind of medical thing happening to me that my parents know right. about and have mm-hmm. never told me. Mm-hmm. I've talked about before where I thought when I was a child that I was intersex because I thought my taint <laughs> was my <laughs> vagina. <laughs> <laughs> but that wasn't true. Yeah. Uh, but something like a, like a twin or like... Um, I, I had a friend growing up who had, he was born with 12 fingers mm-hmm. and oh, then they cut the off his fingers. Mm-hmm. He didn't know about that or? He found, they, his parents told him when he was like in middle school. Oh my God. Isn't that fucked up to yeah. cut yeah. the fingers? Keep the fingers. Keep yeah. the finger. Make your kid cool. It's way cooler than having two little fucking scars. Is there like, yeah. does it, will it kill you if they leave the fingers on? No. They're not deathly. Fi- they're not I feel deadly. like, well, I don't think, I've, I feel like I hear a million stories about this guy was born with 12 fingers. He had to get him cut off. And I've never seen but a guy it's with really, 12 fingers walking It's around. really just yeah. because they're shitty fingers. They're right. like, like, think about how bad your pinky is. I guess is. also when it happens, worse you're, than that. You're, yeah. a, you're a baby and you can't be like, no, I want the fingers. Yeah, like, exactly. Yeah. You can't yeah, be yeah, cool. You can't advocate for yourself. Really? Because boomers didn't know the world was going to get nicer. You know, because if you're like a boomer with 12 fingers, you get the shit kicked out. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. They, they were day. like, it's gonna be a hard circus. life for this kid. <laughs> yeah, 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 you'd yeah. go in the circus, yeah. and that'd be your whole life. Yeah, this like, kid oh, will be the toxic avenger. Yeah, forever. Right. Yeah, the, the twelve fingered man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> give us a nickel. You can see him in this tent. <laughs> but now you'd have more fingers for iPads and iPhones. That's true. Mm-hmm. Which is sad you'd be to really say, good at Pokemon Go. Yeah. yeah. If yeah. I was born with twelve fingers and they cut them off, it would really motivate me to invent a time machine and go back into the opera and be like. Stop. 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 Add more yeah. fingers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Reverse Take my procedure. big toe. I Take would my ride, big toe. I would right trade. Here. Let's see. Which toes do you actually need? You really only need. Pinky toe and big toe, I think. Yeah. yeah okay. The middle ones you can so get rid of. So put the other fucking three on my hands, man. Yeah. And let's, <laughs> get, my finger. let's get to work. Yeah. Can you imagine what kind of jobs I could get walking into the interview? <laughs> They're like, so what are your qualifications? <laughs> I don't know. You t- <laughs> How about you tell me, man? That looks like you have toes on your head. Oh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Am I hired? What the fuck's going on? There's a girl in my German class who had an extra thumb. Wow. She on, would hide currently it. on her? Yeah. She would hide it. She would hide it in was her, it, her sweatshirt. Was it be beautiful or ugly? No, it was on top of her thumb. Was it movable? She had a horn. Yeah, she Separately had like, you movable? know, like when cats have that? It wasn't separately movable. Okay, no. it was just like a horn. No, but she could put a piece of paper between it. Wow. Yeah. So it doesn't sound like the she was that clip. embarrassed. <laughs> 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 She's walking around showing you that she can mm-hmm. do yeah. magic tricks with it. Well, that's well, yeah, they, didn't cut, they didn't cut her extra thumb off because they were like, yeah, you can make a lot of money joining the circus yeah, with the human yeah, clip. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> put a paper between your thumb. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That'd be good for counting money. Yeah, for counting yeah. one bill at a time, maybe, yeah. I guess. Well, it's like, oh, here's, yeah. you know, here's you one. go. Well, I mean, you could stuff. A I wouldn't even have a wallet, there. man. I'd have like a fucking. <gasps> oh, oh. Sorry. No, it's fine. Did he see a bone? <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think that's what he I'm saw. Yeah. I don't know so much about dogs. Yeah. Um, so you could hand it to the doorman like very slickly. Yeah. You know? yeah, good yeah, for exactly. yeah. Good for tipping. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Good mm-hmm. for being a spy. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Um, Drug dealing. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, that would change the whole game. Yeah. Oh my God! Oh yeah, you could also hide when when uh, you were getting arrested right, for drug right. dealing. You can hide right. it behind your hand. Yeah, because it's clipped over on the just back. Just a little side. baggy of blow. Just yeah, oh. yes. Yeah, so we have to have a big. You have to work out your thumb to make yeah, it. Yeah, you have to make too. it strong. Yeah, but that's fine. That's worth it. But that's nothing. Yeah. Work out your thumb. Have you ever known anybody who's horribly disfigured? <laughs> um, not that I know of. Just. No, he's fine. He's cool. I don't think that even comes up on the mic. You know what? There was a guy, I don't know if he's, he's still around, but on the L train, there was like an acid attack guy, and he would have a sign, mm-hmm. and he would say, I got attacked, but somebody threw acid in my face. Oh, oh my God. God. Yeah. I always thought it'd be funny, because I saw him on Halloween once, mm-hmm. to go up and be like, oh, spooky. <laughs> <laughs> that was that, yeah. inside <laughs> joke between, <laughs> between you and that guy. Me and my, yeah, yeah, you're good. And that you're guy. close yeah. personal yeah. friend. Yeah, the yeah, acid yeah. attack yeah. On Halloween, his yeah. costume. He just doesn't wear the sign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I uh, did you? Mm, 
I'm trying to think if I knew somebody who had extra stuff besides the finger guy. Yeah. No, there's a homeless guy near my house who has vol- a volcano on his hand. Wow. Have I talked to you guys about that before? Probably. He has some kind of sore or something that is open, and it has created a like a ridge, and it goes uh-huh. up like this, and it looks like wow. he has a fire power or something, but it's actually That's just cool. a disgusting Maybe he does. abscess. Huh? Maybe he does. He I, said, I think if he had a power, he wouldn't be homeless. No, I think have you seen Hancock? Probably a supervillain. Or a superhero. See, yeah. that's the that's a big plot hole in that. If you were homeless, you'd be a villain. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't be a hero. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. oh, it's subverting the, the the expectations of the audience. Is he homeless? Spider in that Man movie? would be like, get out, move along. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly, dude. You're showing yeah. up to the crimes, you all stinky. The cops would shoot yeah. you instantly. Right, right, right. <laughs> but why why is he not uh like Making money off of that? What do you just drink? Well, beer? I think you should rewatch the movie. I don't remember. I never it. saw the movie. You never saw yeah. Hancock? No. Man, this is a funny movie. Yeah, yeah. it's pretty. It's good. A, is it a comedy movie or it's, it's dramatic? I would call it action Dramedy. half, comedy mm. half. Okay. Yeah, not so much drama. There's not so okay. Not well, I don't know. I mean, he's heard he was homeless. So it's it an addiction be. story. Well, yeah. that sounds like drama to me. But it's is played for movie? laughs. Well, it is action because they do a lot of like close-ups on the beer when he's drinking it. A lot of montage work. Um but it's a very, I mean, I probably saw that movie 40 times when I was a kid, and I don't remember a single thing about it, except yeah. that he sleeps on a bench. Yeah. I wanted to see that movie really bad. My parents wouldn't let me. It was on FX all the time. So you missed out. Yeah, it's out. a good TV movie. Yeah. yeah. Good plane movie, too. He's really just like a homeless plane. superhero? Yeah. Yeah. And people, and he like and then he accidentally meets his saves everybody pretty much every time. Uh-huh. Yeah. He's like always oh. reaching for like a quarter, and then he turns <laughs> okay. out the quarter's on like a train track, <laughs> okay. and there's yeah. people tied up, and he, the train hits him. Nice. Okay. Yeah, it's that kind of shit. Yeah. And it's like just fucking beca- go to the NFL. I guess right. it, it would He goes to, to punch an elderly man in the face, but he hits the bad guy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, it's pretty much that kind of thing. Yeah. It would suck to be a homeless superhero because you'd be, you know, fighting the villain and having this big battle, and you'd kill him or whatever, or send him to jail, and you'd just be like, "Well, I guess I just lie down on the ground." <laughs> 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 Might as well lie yeah. down right here. Interview on the news, and they're like, "Totally, yeah." Spider Man going home, like, oh, you wouldn't believe the day I've had a yeah. Spider. Yeah, him. Just, oh, yeah. Trying, to, just trying to find like, out his secret identity. Anybody have any card? And then he lays yeah. down, <laughs> lays down on the cardboard. You're like. Okay, oh. you can break the. You can go home now. <laughs> we get it. You're Mr. Hobo, the superhero. Yeah. Did you guys ever see any anything by uh, Red Skelton, the comedian from like yes. a long time ago? My dad loves Red Skelton. Yeah, yeah. He had this one like uh, routine. I guess it was. It, he goes. Uh, he's like, all right, this next routine is called "Woman Driving a Car," and he just pretends that he's like a a lady driving a car. Uh huh. He's like doing his makeup in the in the rearview mirror. And uh, he's like, you know, he's like trying to fix his bra when he's driving. <laughs> but there's another sketch that he did where he <laughs> plays a homeless guy. He plays a homeless guy, and he's trying to get arrested because <laughs> okay. so, uh, he wants to like go to because it's like the holidays. Yeah, yeah. And, and it's more fun to, in jail. Uh, yeah, he's yeah. like you get you get meals and you. So he's trying to get himself arrested. That's funny, but he can't because he's too good of a guy or what? Because he's like, he goes to throw a brick through a window uh-huh. and he's talking to this other homeless guy. He's like, yeah, I'm going to go to jail. And the other <laughs> homeless guy's like, I'm going well, to, I better get out of here. <laughs> so he runs away. And he throws the brick through the window uh-huh. and the cops show up and they're like, where'd that guy go? And they go to arrest his oh, friend. Uh, <laughs> yeah. They're like, who throws a brick through a window and stands around? Yeah. When was Red Skelton working? Probably like the 1950s. 1950s. Yeah, something like that. This was yeah. some cutting edge shit. Yeah. yeah. He this was in one of those Christmas movies as Santa, I think. One of the Rankin and Bass ones. That's the only thing I know about him. I just assumed yeah. he was a Christmas guy. You thought he was Santa? Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought most of his stuff was about the holidays, yeah. Can but you pull up a woman so driving stuff. a car so I don't look fucking insane? <laughs> yeah. 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 Just so I can show that it's... Yeah, man. <laughs> no, I don't know. I don't no, know. you don't look that YouTube. crazy. But, but, <laughs> but I should kind of think... Oh, there it is. Google <laughs> yeah, right, so this is, this is Red Skelton. This is a really good sketch. You could tell wow. it's AI. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he does an amazing impression of a woman driving a car. He's not... That's really incredible. It's AI art of a woman, of a woman driving a car because they can't, they couldn't get the shot. <laughs> that video was blurry. It has, to be, it has to be AI. That's the only way you can get that shot. <laughs> now that one's real. Yeah. yeah, drinking the coffee while yeah. you're in the car. Yeah. Um, speak- Although my wife's a very good driver, I have to say. Really? F one. What's that? F one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> my wife is fucking really bad at driving. Really? Really bad, dude. Interesting. And they hate it when you talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> they fucking they hate really it, dude. Like yeah. it. I sit in the passenger seat, and she's like, the big, the big problem is she puts the music at maximum volume okay. so she can't hear anything. And people are honking at her constantly. She has what does no she idea. listen to? Honks Honking and compilation. <laughs> 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 so she just has no idea. Yeah. So she's just driving around. Screaming compilation. After, <laughs> screaming, fuck you, bitch! In the red Ford Focus. Get Ford. out of the fucking road! But yeah, she has no idea. It's her favorite song. You can't, you can't knock that. Her time. Yeah. And she's just fucking, she's swerving. She'll swerve to the music like she's <laughs> DJ Screw. <laughs> just like fucking, it's really, really scary. Nice. But then I get in the car. I drive like a, like a pussy, dude. Mm-hmm. I, I will let anybody cut me off. I've honked. I think I'm up to four honks in my entire, entire life. Entire life, yeah. I, I can't, I've never honk. But I what never does that do? Honk. What does honking the horn do? Nothing. That's what I'm saying. And my wife yeah. will honk at people who are in the crosswalk <laughs> and have the right of way. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And she will just lay on the fucking horn because uh-huh. she wants to take a right turn. Uh-huh. It's that kind of thing. Uh-huh. And I will just never honk, dude. Because I don't want to get shot in the head. It's really that I don't want to get shot in the head either. Yeah. I really try to avoid Does that happen that. a lot? Sometimes. It basically it, all the time. Every once in a yeah. I feel like <laughs> yeah. Yeah. every once in a while. Yeah. I would say once or twice a day somebody gets shot in the head for a honk. Because it's the worst. Because imagine you get shot in your car and you just have to slowly like bleed to death. Like, yeah, that's terrible. Because your wife honked. It's yeah. <laughs> exactly. Dude, that's the other thing is when I'm driving <laughs> with my <laughs> wife. <laughs> you and the passenger <laughs> side <laughs> walk away. When I'm driving with my wife. a woman, that'd be mean. Execution My wife is a young lady. Nobody's going to get out of their Hummer and and go yeah. and beat her up. They're going to kill me. Yeah, yeah. They're going to yeah. fucking kill me yeah, for, yeah. Her sin. for her oh, sin. Oh, I see what you, you leaned over and hung. You yeah. leaned over into the driver's seat. You hung. I know what it was. was. This poor lady. Pulling you out of the window. <laughs> yeah, I try to avoid that situation at all costs because... Um, yeah, yeah. Don't want to. There's just no reason die. to. Yeah. The honking, it just does nothing for me. Yeah, mm-hmm. I don't. Uh, a lot of people use it to get out their aggression, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. but uh, I don't have. Uh, That's better. Care. Going fast is better than that. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Just go fast. I'll just, just go. go way you don't even make a noise. Just go really, really, really fast. Do you have a car in the city? Yeah. Do you like having a car? Is it? Yeah, it's all right. We're getting rid yeah. of it, uh, but yeah, it's not bad when you have to. You're gonna sell it? Go to. Um, it's a lease, so we're just giving it back. Oh, nice. Yeah, a bunch of damage. I did a similar thing. Yeah. Yeah. I got it impounded and then they burned my license plate <laughs> and then they <laughs> put it in a in a lot that costs three hundred bucks a month and it's been sitting there kind of growing mold. Okay. For a oh couple yeah. Months it's got now. all this green mold in it, you saying? Well, six months I think it's I haven't oh had my a car God. for six yeah. months. Yeah. Well, well your well. car was like a target forever like you kept like someone threw a glass bottle through his window I had a Bernie sticker like, on the back of my that's car why. <laughs> <laughs> and somebody <laughs> threw a Heineken bottle uh-huh. through my fucking window yeah the Heineken bottle exploded beer everywhere with little pieces of glass stuck yeah. to everything because of the beer we I did so have a little fucking bad man mm-hmm I had a little Palestine flag but before October 7th uh-huh. on my rearview mirror like the cab drivers have, and then mm-hmm. I, I took it down after mm-hmm. October 7th. <laughs> yeah, you know, the, see, the it money back. that you could be spend, that you would have to spend on uh, calling Safe Light, you can just yeah. donate that money. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah, better. Yeah, yeah. It's a better use of that money than yeah. having to pay to the tax for having a, uh, sure. for being a good guy, I yeah. guess. <laughs> Yeah, driving that around South Williamsburg, you'd be, uh-huh. <laughs> dude, you'd get a couple bottles through the window. Yeah, well, that's just because it's a car and they haven't seen it. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 they're not Amish. Uh, listen, Mike, you have a stand up special coming out, man. I'm yeah. curious to ask you, what is it like to have recorded a stand up special? This is the crown jewel of the comedian's life. Yeah, well, anybody can do it. No, but not all of them can go on YouTube, man. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. So tell me. Yeah, well, you know, we shot it like over a year ago. Really? Yeah, and just I don't like you know it's hard to watch yourself. So yeah, fucking I that's all. I have nightmares about taping a special and having to go and do the edit. Yeah, and being like, wait, I fucking saw <laughs> yeah. Wait. I'm standing so gay. <laughs> you look like yeah. shit. I'm not funny. Why am I so fat? Yeah, this is yeah. awful. Can yeah, we? I, I look yeah. 42 years old. Can we make me skinnier in the edit? <laughs> we, is this could. like the liquify yeah. effect? Just moving. I'm just doing just Instagram like, filters. Yeah. On my yeah. 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 My stand-up special. I hate yeah. listening to myself so much. I mean, I I used to edit this podcast, and now we pay somebody so to just so you do don't that. have to do it. Yeah. I don't have to hear my voice every week. Yeah, no, that's yeah. terrible. Seeing yourself do anything is really, really terrible. Oh, yeah. It's horrible. Yeah, I'd I would rather not. 
No, no, no. That's why we don't have security cameras. You can take anything in mm -hmm. here because yeah. I will never be reviewing that footage. <laughs> I really want to put a security camera up just over the trash can outside. Let's oh, see yeah. Throw stuff in there. And We've been shame them, putting posters mm -hmm. up, mm -hmm. wanted posters. Yeah, mm -hmm. this guy Vigilante. threw away his trash. <laughs> threw away his trash, <laughs> <in our> trash <laughs> <can>. <laughs> you used our trash, and now you will pay for it. Well, you but, told yeah. me the funniest thing about there's a big problem in this neighborhood actually. Of mm -hmm. people get a lot of these, a lot of trash cans have signs uh, that are like, "Don't throw dog poop in this. You are, we will be on camera." Yeah. And a lot of people have locks on their trash. The cans. locks yeah. are so funny. The yeah, locks. Funny. I want to get a lock. I do too. I never even thought that that was a. The a, thing is, these invention. people are such animals. Yeah, they will just put the trash on top of the can. Mm -hmm. They will. What you got to get is a fucking laser beam. Yeah, so you we got a, a whole McChicken one time. Somebody just took somebody two bites, impaled a McChicken impaled on it our through fence our, through the spike over okay. there. This yeah. is a. I mean, I just can't and believe. I, I always this push shit. the trash can all the way up against the wall inside the fence. People so nobody grab can, it. People grab it and mm -hmm. pull it to the fence to throw their shit away. What yeah. the hell, man? That's what they, I think. I truly think. I think we should get a camera. We should put it above the trash can, and then every there every, is at one the out end there. Of every episode we put the footage. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so just show all the faces, man. Our freaks really of the far. week. Yeah. If the dog poop is bagged, though, it's fine. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, just what, let them throw yeah. it out. I mean, Where's it going to go? And very few people are like holding their dog up and having it shit <laughs> into the <laughs> trash can. <laughs> like, I don't know how else would get the, the right. poop in there. Yeah. But um, it's just a fun thing to get mad about. And then yeah. you told me that. Well, you can dump it in the, um, the can and reuse the bag. Oh, true. that's true. So you can true. save some money that way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Put the yeah. bag back in your pocket. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I have had to do. Sometimes I'll, I've never left a dog poop on the ground. I think that no, is. No, I don't think I have. I think that's a, that's a really wrong thing to do. Unforgivable. Yeah. I think it's unforgivable. So I have sometimes run out of bags and walked up and down the street looking for like big gulp cups. And then you have to <laughs> yeah. scoop. It's one of the worst things ever. Yeah, Should have never gotten a dog, man. These yeah, are disgusting yeah. animals. Dude, I was thinking about this the other day. Like I like I like living in New York and this neighborhood's really nice. But it is crazy that every day I see 100 poops. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just, you, that's, that's yeah. just, I never would have dogs. expected that would be like part of my life. It's like, oh, yeah. I'm going to go outside. Oh, there, yeah, poop. There's oh, poop. There's you can't tell if it's ground. a dog's poop either. No, a lot of it isn't, I think. Some, of these, some people have like giant dogs that right. have like right. human-sized shits. Yeah. And you're like, oh, it's, my neighbor's weird. It's but just, it is a little sus to bend over and pick up dog poop. I yeah. think about this yeah. is why I have incorporated. I do a Japanese style squat. Okay, nice. Down to the ground with my ankles yeah. on the still on the ground, yeah. and that's how I pick it up. Because yeah. the, I would the bending over is not a good. I would look. walk around with like a, a big vacuum cleaner on my back, like a ghost people. Yeah. <laughs> you can squeeze people. it between your shoes and kick it up. And <laughs> <laughs> doing hold a, the bag over doing a rainbow <laughs> above my head yeah. into the trash can. <laughs> there, uh, there are people who walk around with the scoopers and stuff. <clears throat> Yeah. Um, but that looks even worse to me. Than yeah. Yeah. You can't have a machine. Do that it. looks like you're a collector. It looks Take like you're collecting your own, your own dog yeah. poop. And honestly, mm -hmm. it's kind of sus to use a bag, too. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, so like basically a well, condom. Use your bare hand, rugged hand. You can take, you can find a can and rip a little piece of plastic off the, off the bag, and pick it up with that. That works too. That's what I've done. You've done. I, was, I don't love yeah. doing that, but or you I, could go into a bodega and ask for just a and a roll, plain roll. Well, no, you would want to. You'd want to. You'd want a hero because then you could. Yeah, cut, exactly. you could clamp it. <laughs> right. You guys have a hot dog box. It up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then you stick it in the community fridge, and yeah. then. My day's done, man. <laughs> yeah, no, now you've provided. Now yeah. you've provided for your community. Yeah. Someone's getting a meal later. Sometimes I want to get the food out of those fridges so fucking badly. The community yeah. food? Yeah. Yeah. But they're I, always empty. I check. They're dude. always empty. <laughs> <laughs> I saw some baked ziti in there the other oh, day. Yeah. And that was tempting me because mm -hmm. I was in the mood for Italian food. But mm -hmm. then I remembered that... Uh, that's probably for people who are very hungry. <laughs> yeah. It's not just like free so food. That's so funny. Well, I, I mean, was looking you were technically at it like, very I was basically like drooling looking into it. And yeah. then your ex girlfriend is like, Caleb, I haven't seen you in a while. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't see the ad. <laughs> or come. Yeah, that would be so You're awesome. like, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm not poor. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm just hungry. <laughs> if He's somebody, really hungry. If somebody like <laughs> listens to the podcast, hold on, hold on. By, yeah. <laughs> Eating. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I just love baked ziti. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have a good recipe for I'll it. I buy all the baked ziti in this neighborhood. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is the only good one. Is from the fridge. Yeah, I, yeah. yeah. It just hits different. Yeah. I guess it's like I guess you 
you can do it like a like a lending library or whatever, like those little ones where yeah. you you replace it with a book or whatever. Yeah, oh, yeah. But I'm not gonna. Fuck I show it. up to the community fridge and I bring like a, a, a carrying a microwave under my arm with like a portable <laughs> generator, <laughs> and taking all the food out, warming it up first. Yeah, you just find a cold book. <laughs> <laughs> I get really confused. <laughs> this, I put is the Bible. this is the Bible they have at the hotels. <laughs> <laughs> what is this doing in the what community? Is this cold fridge? Bible doing in here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it's nice that that kind of stuff is uh, around, but I've never, I don't think I've ever seen anybody actually get the food out of it. I think no. most of it probably goes bad, I would assume. I see people line up for it. For the community fridge? Yeah. Really? Or it might be a thing that they do by the community fridge. It's like, oh, different like a community. food pantry like, thing? Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. But yeah, I see, I see people. I used to be out. heavy into the food pantry in college, man. Me too, man. That was the, that was the best shit of all <laughs> Dude, time. Oh, yeah. I would eat those, you know, it's like bagged lentils. Uh-huh. I would eat like six of those every day from that thing. I would clean them out of bagged lentils. What it, was it? Just a, a food? A it was like a food pantry at our college. It was uh, free? Yeah, yeah. And it was That's like, great. but you had to like, they did it in such a bad way where you had to like come in, you had to sign your name. Yeah, they wanted to keep track of who was getting the yeah, stuff. So and yeah, and it was mostly, it, I would look at the sheet and it would be like, Caleb Cameron. <laughs> 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 Nobody knew about it either. No yeah. one knew about it, yeah. yeah. We were, it was very few people who were poor enough that they had to research how to get free yeah. food. Yeah. And me it and Cameron life were saver, man. basically best. legends. We'd come oh, in. Life, they had lifesavers? They, they did. They, can, a, they did have candy. Uh, they had, I was saying it was a lifesaver. Oh, it was awesome. oh, I thought you were saying. But they you did it, yeah. No, it was like, you know, time. there was stuff like, oh, there's like ramen and mac and cheese, but then it's like, okay, there's also like cookies. And yeah. Like it's yeah. Like, yeah. Rice yeah. Krispie treats. And Ooh. we would usually. Oh, I'm so hungry, bro. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm so poor. Well, I, guess I should oh, I eat need all lunch right candy. now. And I remember they would. Chocolate covered pretzels. Did, they, did you ever talk to the people there? A little bit. They were very nice, but they would always like try to get you to go to some kind of like counseling thing <laughs> they would like try to they would if you talk to them for a little while they'd be like oh we can you get human traffic yeah, yeah. I, th- <laughs> I thought it, it seemed like some, some kind of honeypot situation yeah 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 where they were trying yeah. to trick me into devil therapy You're like no thanks i'm just here for the lentils yeah, <laughs> right, yeah. don't talk to me <laughs> <laughs> yeah i well that was the other thing is i really didn't like uh be i i, I didn't like that i was a regular at the food pantry yeah yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. That's that was not awesome because I went every day and I didn't want to go stock up for I didn't want to go in and take forty five bags yeah Yeah. like the Criterion because then I'm taking money I'm taking food this one oh this (laughs) this one (laughs) yeah the Madras classics yeah it's honestly one of the foods that got me interested in food (laughs) as a kid (laughs) (laughs) I've still never seen one of those videos man they're really boring I don't know why they are so popular it sounds like the most boring video ever they are do you know those Mike the the Criterion Closet is that yeah, what it's the called? Yeah, Criterion Closet. It's the like Criterion Collection. They have a closet with all the movies in it, and they just get like directors and actors to come in and just take movies and talk about which ones they're taking. And it's it is it. Everyone's oh my god, it's the new one. And as they walk in, and they like, and because the Criterion Collection also has like. A th- like you know a thousand movies yeah. in it. it's not like they're gonna s- pick something and you're gonna be like what yeah. yeah it's like they're all like good movies yeah right <laughs> yeah oh, this is a guy who makes movies is gonna come in and say five good movies and they've been picked yeah. by the criterion and collection. he gets to take yeah. them home yeah the, the, yeah the guy Wait, they get dra- to take them yeah movies? that's yeah. what it is they, they're taking them they, they get them for free, free. Yeah, they're it's millionaires. just that you go and you right. get free movies and you talk about it. you get free movies for already being famous yeah yeah that's what they should need to have a Criterion collection for homeless people. All right, that they come in and get, get all the, the blue rays. Blu-ray, yeah. 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 That puts me over the edge. I'm going to become a famous actor. Yeah. yeah. If you also get to a get free, free DVD, DVDs, yeah. however many times. I forget yeah. who it was. There's a couple of them where the people come in and take like like 30 Blu-ray. Like usually people come in and take like you know like four or five. But there's mm. a few where people are like fucking mm. like taking mm. everything. It's so funny. Yeah. yeah like, really, that's man. Rude. <laughs> they are kind of greedy sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. I um, one time I rented uh, uh, the movie The Savages from the library mm-hmm. and I was returning it and there was a guy on the train and he was like, I think a little mentally challenged. Mm-hmm. And he was like, oh, you got a you got a movie. And I'm like, yeah, he's like, what movie you got? And I'm like, uh, it's called The Savages. <laughs> and he was like, what's that? And I was like, <laughs> and then I had to like explain the plot of The Savages uh-huh. to this like mentally challenged guy. <laughs> I'm like, it's about these two siblings and they have to go home to Buffalo to care for their <laughs> ailing father. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be bad if you had picked up a copy of Freaks and you yeah. were <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like, what's that? It's like, ah, Toy Story. Yeah. yeah. It's a movie I about toys. They come to life at night. Yeah. <laughs> I need to do a rewatch of those movies, man. What? Toy, Toy Story, 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 man. They're, they're good. They're good. Well, you, yeah. oh, you have a baby. Yeah. So you watch a lot of kids' movies. We've been watching a lot of kids' what movies. What is, yeah. I'm so curious because every kid has their movie that they're, 
like watch every day, that kind of thing. Yeah, we don't make it to the end of anything. Yeah, but uh, we've been watching um, Puss in Boots: The Last Wish. That's oh, the new one where he has a panic attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's got anxiety. That's really yeah. Yeah. sweet. Mm-hmm. That uh, is, I do want to see that footage of Antonio Banderas like in the studio. <laughs> like, okay, <laughs> now you're now you're having a full on panic attack. How do they even oh, get no. a guy that? <laughs> yeah, well, he probably has. He's such a like suave, he, cool guy. He's yeah. no idea what that is. Right. Yeah. So they had to tell right. him like tell act like you've been having sex for like forty five <laughs> hours and you're out of breath. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> Okay, so there's a bunch of women who just want to have sex with you, and you have to do it. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> yeah, they're just, like, tricking him the entire time. He finally sees him. He's like, I'm a cat. He thinks he's playing himself. He's got to sue the puppy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're like, okay, for this movie, we're going to do the audio first, and we'll film you later. <laughs> 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 that would have been cool if they just put him in Shrek, yeah, you know, instead of some dumbass little mm-hmm. cat. Fuck mm-hmm. that cat. So you've seen how you've seen Puss in Boots how many times at this point? I've seen the beginning like maybe ten or fifteen times. Wow, oh, that's actually yeah. not that bad. Yeah, my little brother when I was growing up, I have a brother who's like fifteen years younger than me, so I babysit him a lot. I have seen Cars one front to back mm. probably a hundred times. Really, yeah. front to back, front to back. Was that one as good? Because it's hard. It's like weird. It's a weird story. Yeah, it's not. There's not a lot going on. How like do they like he, reproduce? He's like in. <laughs> I don't yeah. think they touch upon that. <laughs> <laughs> they don't. I'm trying, trying to think if they ever have a kid. And I think they have yeah. eggs. Yeah, they like car eggs or something. Yeah, they have or, a flamethrower. <laughs> like yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I I think uh, uh, there's. I don't know if there's a kid. I don't think there is a kid. Or they no. give birth. One of the cars goes into labor. Yeah, it was like they come out of their fucking... That was a deleted scene. Yeah, just yeah. The, the trunk. trunk yeah, yeah, the trunk just opens <laughs> up. Yeah. The trunk and there's another car out. that comes out. Yeah. yeah. That's disgusting. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but that movie doesn't make a lot of sense. It doesn't make either. a lot of sense. Because he, yeah. no. he like gets arrested... And then he get he becomes a slave for a whole town, <laughs> and then yeah. they let him go because he has to go to work. That's yeah, like yeah. the whole movie. I don't think I've ever seen that. I I'm think that came either. out like I was probably like nine years old, so I was already into like Viva La Bam and shit. Hmm. I was like, oh, that's fucking. You skip gay. Cars, dude. <laughs> yeah, I skipped Cars. What's the, I also what's the last cars. Pixar movie yeah. you saw in theaters? Probably the third Toy Story, though. I did see that one because it's like well, I did see that Toy in Story. theaters too. Yeah. I remember this from when I was a kid. You were cars, still I was like, I'm not, I don't care. Cars was cool, man. Yeah. They become a spy. I also thought they Cars made, like, was three gay as a kid. I don't yeah. know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> In the third one, he gets, he does a, he dies, basically. So. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. And I remember that. Yeah, but you can just bring him to a, that was a body one of shop. The coolest. That trailer is that crazy. Trailer, I remember yes. that trailer, so dude. Unbelievable. Because a teenager good. bought him and yeah. was drunk driving. Yeah. Yeah. He, he was racing his friends. And then he hit a, he hit a wall at 110 <laughs> miles an hour. That would be an awesome reveal. That was the, that's the opening scene of Cars 3. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Life is a highway. He yeah. Yeah. becomes be some kid's first car. <laughs> <What? Yeah. laughs> uh, uh, that trailer. It's like, this sucks. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone got really mad. They hired <laughs> They made it woke. <laughs> <laughs> that trailer is up there with uh, uh, sh- what's that movie called? Shrinking. Mm-hmm. Oh, the downsizing. Yeah. downsizing mm-hmm. with mm-hmm. the best trailers of all time. Yeah. And the movie tra- is just mid. Do you remember the Cars Three trailer? No. Uh, so the first yeah. one was the one I was just taught was the one where he becomes a slave. The second mm-hmm. one, Mater, mm-hmm. Larry the Cable Guy, becomes James Bond. Mm. Okay, and this this one's very very cool. And then the third one. The trailer, like they're kind of getting more and more absurd as the the series goes along. And then the third one, the trailer is just a minute long uh, footage of Lightning McQueen crashing, and his like body is flying into yeah. pieces. Yeah, and everyone's going, "Oh my god! And like, he's, oh my god! He's gone. Lightning he's McQueen is <laughs> dead! He's dead!" <laughs> and it's like the most dramatic. And they do the fucking, like fading in the like yeah. Yeah, sound of, yeah. They really, and I didn't even. I don't think I even saw the movie. But yeah. uh, if it's not all like that, I think I'd be pretty disappointed. If they yeah. didn't go for a full like, it opens up. It's like Ferrari. prom night, twenty fourteen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I really think it's now, a cautionary tale. That should yeah, yeah. be the fourth movie. Is they should just reveal that there's been people the whole time. Yeah. yeah. Did they do that at your high school where like around prom season they would put like they would find like a a car that was in a drunk driving accident <clears> and put it on the lawn of the. 
no. the high school. No, that's no. pretty hardcore, though. That that's is. Crazy. Like a car that a real person died in? Yeah. Oh, my wow. God. They would, like, that's rent nuts. it, I guess. <laughs> I guess there was a company that rented messed up cars. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> you can donate your, your... Frankie, stop! Frankie. <laughs> Come here. You want me to bring him over here? Yeah, I don't yeah. care. He's not... Like racist or anything. <laughs> really? Yeah. Because I'm looking out of the I don't window know what and I think he might be. I don't know what he's seeing. <laughs> well, there is a bus stop right there. It's a, yeah, but yeah, so he's lots, of people, <laughs> lots of people ride the bus. He's seeing every, exactly. Everybody rides the Everybody bus. Everybody rides the he's bus. Every he's, different he's definitely right. Some, yeah. Something in there he's not liking. I'm sorry. You no, you grab him? Uh, you're fine. He's, I think he's, he's good. Now. Yeah, I'm not too worried about it. Um, fuck, what was it? Oh, yeah. So when you die in a car accident, you can donate your car to education. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, yeah I guess that's the lesser thing of like, uh, <clears throat> you know, you you donate your organs after you die. Yeah, like, yeah. thank yeah. you so much, and, you, and I also right. donate my car to <laughs> a high school. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah, man. Yeah, whatever, whatever you <laughs> yeah, want. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. sure. <laughs> they would put this fucked up car on the lawn of the high school and be like, "This is what'll happen if you drink and drive." And then people but just take pictures in it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Senior prank. Like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, like, uh, 40s in both hands. Like, uh, dude, doing Edward 40 hands in the drunk driving oh car would God. be so fucking awesome, man. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't have anything like that. I don't Do think... they re upholster the car? Because I imagine right. there's a. If it's no. that Flat, fucked up, yeah, there. there's probably oh, a big stain on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fucked up. Yeah. 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 I, I hope they don't like, get in a pool. Yeah. Yeah. Well, imagine like they do that, and then like it's like, oh my god, the interior of this thing is beautiful. <laughs> Actually, I'll take it. Right. I'll take it. How the much? Seats are yeah, these seats are. How amazing. much to drive this off the lot? Right oh my god, now. that's a, that's a pebble grain leather. What yeah. the fuck? Yeah. Me and my friends added some of our own stains to that car. Oh, <laughs> I like, yeah. on prime night. You yeah, yes, off on sir. It. Yeah, you jacked off on the dead kid's car. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> If you catch my drift. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, you have to get out of the car. I'm not done. <laughs> I'm not done. Yeah. Yeah. But I was also like, did they have like a warehouse where they had where they just kept those cars? They must have some Indiana Jones yeah. warehouse yeah. where there's just a bunch of cars that kids yeah. died in. Yeah. Drunk driving. Yeah. They find like the worst like school. They have to get like the worst car. The mm -hmm. one that's just like a cube. Yeah. They just completely <laughs> fucked it up. Yeah. One one yeah. piece of metal. Yeah. Do you guys hey kids, you know what this is? <laughs> <laughs> this could be you. Yeah. Not being able to get a <laughs> fucked up car one year and be like, yeah, this car crashed so bad it doesn't exist anymore. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Flew out into <laughs> orbit. Yeah. Yeah. The, we just have a time. Just one the, tire. the school budget is just tanked so yeah. hard. You can't even rent the drunk driving car. Why is there a tire on the front? Yeah. Well, it's I guess it's a all drunk driver. Left. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> he was so drunk, he took his tire off and rode it all That's the way home. That's an amazing job to have as a guy who works at a high school. I guess it's like the counselor's job. Your whole job yeah. is like scare kids. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. fucking awesome, man. And then you well, hire you other guys to scare kids <laughs> to yeah. not do drugs and shit. We had like a hell's angel come to our middle school one time, our middle school health class. And uh, t tell stories about being a hell's angel. I just thought this was a good idea. Guys. <laughs> <laughs> I know, it's, cool. it's just he just sits around the house all day. Frankie, <laughs> let me grab him. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, this guy, this like hell's angel, came to our. He hates this school. story. So <laughs> much, yeah, yeah. Let me just bring him over here. That's yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah. Um. Did you guys have dare? Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. No, we had something called the oh, Tiger wait. program. Yeah, what was it again? And it was like I don't know, it was like an anti-bullying thing, but one of the guys looked like Matthew Lillard, so we all thought that Shaggy was at school. Whoa. It was kind of wow. cool, but Yeah, you can't wait, be you had you like had but it wasn't it didn't have anything to do with drugs or alcohol or anything? No, no, no. Whoa. Oh. oh. <laughs> Whoa. Wait, cut to that camera. That was cool. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> All right, put it back over there. Um, it was an anti-bullying thing? It was anti-bullying. I don't think they talked about <laughs> drugs at all or any kind of thing like that. But, yeah, we had that. I know we had this guy named Mr. G who would just come in, and he you could just ask him, like, have you ever done cocaine? He'd be like, yeah. That's what it should be. It should be a guy who's done that's, everything. That's yeah. what, they always had the, the assemblies where the guy would come in who used to be a drug addict, mm -hmm. and he would be like, like, 55 minutes of the assembly would be him being like, I was on top of the world. <laughs> yeah. I, was, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I played basketball. I was dunking on the basketball court. And then he, at the yeah. end, he'd be like, but then 
I had to stop. <laughs> yeah. See, I did not say anything. Why? That's <laughs> sad. Yeah. yeah. That's this hell's totally angel sad. came to our health class in middle school and talk, told the story about how he like killed a guy. Like, <laughs> 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 he goes like, the last time I was in jail, it was for um. It was for murder one. And then he's like, his <laughs> eyes got like watery and he Whoa. had to stop. And then I, I got really uncomfortable. Mm-hmm. And he told the story about how him and his biker friends like dr- rode up to some guy and beat him with clubs. Oh my God. On their, on their bike. And that was to make you not <laughs> do drugs. Yeah. 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 Well, it wasn't, he didn't, his wife honked at us. And we couldn't, guy. we can't kill a woman with baseball. Yeah. Yeah. We're yeah. hell's yeah. angels. We have yeah, we're not animals. Well, we have to kill yeah. somebody. Yeah. <laughs> we got to kill somebody. Yeah. Yeah. Something. We're all keyed up now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's, um, yeah. Uh, yeah. Seeing it's just a woman alone in the car and hawking and just being like, <sighs> I'm just walking in the next car. Yeah, right? yeah, this car time to kill the mailman. <laughs> this dragon guy on killing. This FedEx driver is done. I don't get. How did that even tie into like health? The, the, uh, yeah, health. Don't yeah. die. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't be uh, yeah. a murderer. Yeah, and then he like handed out Bible pamphlets at the end of the seminar. Oh, wow. that's yeah. what it was, dude. It's these, like, it's so fucking awesome that these murderers have just like get out of jail free card with this Bible thing. Yeah. They're just like, mm-hmm. like, of course you like the Bible. They say yeah, right. like, oh, you're fine. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah. you killed a guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's not so awesome. Yeah. Yeah. I, um, I didn't really have that. My dare guy was basically because I was homeschooled. Yeah. So my dare guy like, I'll was. I'll tell you what saved my life, <laughs> Judy. <and stuff>. <laughs> <laughs> that would be an interesting. That would be a lot it's more interesting. It's a big reveal. He puts a yarmulke on. <laughs> <laughs> Check me out. <laughs> the Old Testament saved my life. <laughs> yeah, uh, I didn't have I didn't have dare. My basically my brother was my dare. Yeah, okay. where it was like if you smoke weed, you are uh, old. You're older than you. <laughs> I, mean, I, I guess I don't know. Your younger brother? My older brother. Okay. He he smoked weed. Okay. And, w- and then what happened? Was he okay? Uh, no, he he got addicted to the stuff. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Pretty much pretty, immediately. It was pretty mm-hmm. sad. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But yeah, it's so funny. How, like, is he okay now? Oh yeah, dude. He's opening a pool hall, man. Oh okay. Yeah, the weed. I mean, so good. The weed basically took him out for so long, but then he he rose from the ashes once he put down the dope. Nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, did you guys have? Do you have siblings? Yeah, you have siblings, right? Yeah. Did uh did you guys have a thing where like you're, well you you are the only one who's an older brother right yeah were you, were your parents weird about your older brother like smoking weed and then when you no, came to he, weed age they didn't care at all yeah that's, that's what pretty much like what it was family. oh really as, as me as but my brother didn't my smoke weed at all my brother's thing was cigarettes and he would just steal my mom's cigarettes and they they caught him with the toaster in his room one time because he couldn't find a lighter <laughs> so, oh, that's so he had the toaster and was lighting it off the toaster okay. and my dad that found is it in his crazy room yeah, that's i nuts. mean it's a smart his dad thing made to him do. Eat a whole loaf of bread <laughs> <laughs> he, he thought he was just making toast. Oh, well that's how okay, we tried to get out steal of it. my toast that's how he tried to get out of it he told my parents like i heard i you're heard punished, them. You're <laughs> no i just wanted Breakfast in bed. You're gonna eat carbs till you're sick. Oh, you like carbs that much? Okay, we're keto in this house, you bastard. Yeah, they fucking they would catch him smoking cigarettes out the window all the time, and it was just like, yeah, I can get away with whatever. I can do whatever the hell I want. They're not gonna find shit. The They're to- too worried about that. The fucking toaster kind of took you the have cake. To, I mean, that actually, if your kid is so addicted to cigarettes that he's using a toaster to light them, yeah, I well, think that my mom is a would problem. hide the lighters, not the cigarettes. No. <laughs> I mean, you go to work, you forget that you like left them there. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, I'd bring them. You're with rushing me. to work, you know. Yeah, I'd be bringing cards of yeah, cigarettes. Sounds like yeah. I wasn't trying very hard. Yeah. to stop you guys from smoking. Yeah, well, look what happened. <laughs> but you leaving could, the toaster out. <laughs> that is yeah. smart though to like light a cigarette. I've never. I would so, never yeah. consider that you could do that. Yeah, yeah it yeah. was really smart. I would. I don't know how to light a fire. Like I, I would not <laughs> yeah. know. I yeah, would you be. Just go, you go like this with a stick. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I would be trying to do that. Literally, I would have no idea how else to light something. Yeah. Although when I used to smoke weed carts, I remember I broke. I. I didn't have a battery because my battery broke. So I stripped the wire of an Android charger and I would put like the positive inside of the cartridge and the negative outside. Oh my God. And that's how I smoked weed for like six months because I didn't want to pay $10 <laughs> to, buy, to buy another fucking yeah, battery. It is difficult getting like that shit when you're like 16 too. I like was 22. Like, oh. Yeah. I was that 22. changes the whole story. I just didn't want to spend 10 bucks. That changes like, that's, everything. That's five bags of rice. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, that's a waste of money. Yeah. Yeah, I when I was like, I, mean, I was like stealing his cigarettes that he would steal. 
and use the and use the fucking toaster too. He was like thirteen doing that shit though. I was like twelve. And just would you like, always oh, just bring man. the toaster up into your room and then bring it back? Yeah. Well, he didn't. He wouldn't do it. Would your dad? Would did your parents ever like try to make <laughs> toast? Get to a room with a toaster. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do? You better be killing yourself. Sir. <laughs> <laughs> you better not be smoking fucking weed again. <laughs> no, but he found these like. I, I, my uncle was in the Air Force and he left his like, uh, what's that fucking thing called? He had the, the, like a big like foot locker and in that he had like a care package that he had like a carton of like, wait, that's Harley a real thing, a foot locker? Yeah. <laughs> what's it for? Like it's, shoes? Like, like your boots and like it's your like, uniform and shit. So he had uh, like, it's just like a his locker combat boots. basically on the ground. Yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah. So he it's had like chest. his combat boots, like his old uniform and stuff. And then like two cartons or like one or two cartons of like cigarettes. And one of them was like Harley Davidson brand. And that's what that's my brother tight. was smoking in his bedroom. <laughs> was these Har- it was like black box with like the Harley logo. And he was like, dude, check this out. <laughs> <laughs> that's so fucking cool, man. Like, yeah, of course I'm going to smoke those. It's fucking the Harley logo. Did you smoke growing up? No, not really. Were you? Mm. I feel like you're at the, you're in that age bracket where smoking was not, people didn't like smoking, right? Yeah. Yeah, like when you were growing up? Yeah. Like early 2000s, people didn't really like they kinda, smoking. Yeah, they were big on... They kind of drilled it into your head not to do it. You had yeah. the lady with the... <laughs> that lady? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You shouldn't smoke. It's like what? It's like... <laughs> It'll turn you into an alien. Because I'll, yeah. yeah. I'll get a power up? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking... Yeah. Oh, I get to sound like a cool robot? <laughs> I get to sound like Scream? Yeah. It's, it's cool, man. Yeah. So you didn't do any of that kind of thing? Not I didn't. Really. Oh, I thought you were talking to me. I Fuck didn't smoke you, weed at all. You didn't, but did you smoke no. weed growing up? Not like a little bit. Where are you yeah, from again? Jersey. Jer- what part of Jersey? Like central near uh, central Trenton. Jersey. So mm. you did pills. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I like that. Yeah. That's Exhaust cool. fumes. Yeah. That was yeah. the thing there. Spray I, paint. Snack, I snacked really heavily. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was the, the drug of choice. Yeah. I got a lot of cold cuts. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that makes sense. I need a deli tray of cold cuts in my. In my room. And just pass mm. the fuck out. So much well, ni- hey, nitrite. You could have a toaster in there, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Toasting the meat? Yeah. Well, I mean, you could toast the bread. You could make sandwiches. Yeah, yeah, make a whole sandwich in there. Yeah, yeah I guess. Yeah. yeah. dickhead. <laughs> it makes sense. <laughs> Barely. It makes complete and total sense. I have a... I, something about cold cuts. I don't know what it is. They've, as I get older, they're starting to really disgust me. I have a, me, too, man. I can't do it anymore. I have, like, really? two, guys are crazy. So interesting. two you bring things... That, yeah. They're like really bad for you. They're too. bad yeah. for you. Yeah. There's so many bad things in them. RBST. What is that? Roast beef. Oh, roast <laughs> beef. <laughs> I guess you're right. <laughs> or whatever that is. They all have shit on them. They yeah. all. I don't robust. like. Robust. I think it's bad to eat the asterisk. Any food that has a million asterisks on it, yeah. and everything of roast beef I get, mm. it's got forty thousand asterisks yeah. that are saying. This contains phenyl lemon Yeah. yeah. Go, and it ah, starts with a pH. You don't want it. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's in Dr. Pepper, Food. too. The final nucleide or whatever. Yeah, well, that yeah. stuff's healthy, though. So yeah, yeah, Dr. Exactly. Pepper's healthy. Well, that's it's carbonated, medicine. so it yeah. bounces It's made by out. a doctor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I still, I don't know why. I think that eating a sandwich is a healthy option. Like a big it kind Italian of is cold cut to combo. Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it is in a way. Well, when we were growing up, it was like the healthiest thing. Yeah, right. Turkey sandwich is fine. Comparatively. No, I'm talking like Italian BMT from... Well, it's because of Subway. Mm -hmm. That's why I think You're talking about unhealthy sandwich. Yeah. Yeah. I'm talking about a a big cold cut. Yeah, it could be anything. It's such a broad thing that... It could, yeah. it could be healthy. It really depends. Not on the, the sandwiches I'm picking. You could eat a salad, like, but it could be a lobster s- yeah. fucking salad with mayonnaise and all that kind well, of shit. Well, that's healthy. A lobster salad. <laughs> lobster salad with mayonnaise. Yeah. yeah. That's healthy. <laughs> that's a healthy thing to eat. Uh-huh. But I heard you'll get pancreatic cancer if you eat the processed deli meats like five times a week. Ah, shit. Really? <laughs> yeah, your risk goes up like 65%. Oh, my God. God. Yeah. Well, that's uh, that's a good chunk of my diet. <laughs> yeah. Well, I. But my kids start a new preschool next month, so my wife's like, he's got he has to pack his lunch now, so mm-hmm. we got to get him used to like turkey sandwiches and stuff. Yeah. You got to go so, Korean on this one, man. Yeah, you yeah. think? Yeah, you got to. Like, what else do I pack him that's not a turkey sandwich? <laughs> well, dude. Yeah, I would really like to see Bulgogi. a YouTube yeah. video of you making hand rolled sushi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You might be interested in that. Okay. I think that'd be okay. cool. Okay. Making that would actually be very yeah. cute. Is you record all you, you are you do you yeah. like cooking? Yeah. You, yeah, you made yeah, yeah. pasta sauce. Yeah, yeah. What happened to that pasta sauce? 
Um, the jars are like really heavy, so it's hard to like carry around. <laughs> and the, and <laughs> you can't really travel with it. The, yeah. the, you know. Wait, what? What was the model? Because you sold pasta sauce, right? I sold pasta sauce. What was yeah. the model for that? You make a, a bunch of you make a bunch of jars. Okay. You could probably make like tw- twelve cases at a time, mm-hmm. and then six or <laughs> no, maybe six cases at a time. Okay. But uh, yeah, you sell them at like a maybe a. 75 or 60 percent markup something like that where did you sell them to just people just friends yeah oh shit okay. but the you know the jars are heavy so you only carry like five or six in your backpack at a yeah. time. So, uh, so you can't walk around on the street and sell wait it you were doing no. door to door <laughs> uh and then sometimes i would put them in like the trunk of my car and sell oh, okay. out of there but if it's too cold or too hot outside yeah. you don't want to yeah. leave them in that there. Make, you didn't have distribution like yeah TSA will confiscate them. <laughs> That's true. God You're like, I thought we lived in a free country. <laughs> <laughs> it's just taking 12 <laughs> fucking jars. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they open the, yeah, yeah, yeah. They open the Now, if I luggage. was white, would you be doing <laughs> this? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's all of your hands. They're doing the swap yeah. test. Yeah. 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 See what it is? Yeah. Just a white shirt covered in pasta sauce. <laughs> yeah, 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 you TSA. also definitely, yeah. you would Six be... Six jars of pasta sauce were seized today. At, you uh, you would airport. definitely be taken out of security line at yeah. Look through your luggage just because mm. they'd be like, that guy has pasta sauce <laughs> in, his, too much. in his luggage. There's no doubt. Yeah. Yeah. That guy, Michaels of Brooklyn, really stole your flow, huh? Um, His came out around the same time that mine did. Yeah. But uh-huh. I never thought that sauce was very good. Damn. But Ooh. sauce war. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, hold uh-huh. on. But if you, if you want to make a good pasta sauce, you just get a can of um, like San Marzano tomatoes, mm-hmm. which is like you get those for like four bucks at Trader Joe's. Mm-hmm. You get a half a stick of butter, half an onion. You simmer that for like 30 minutes in mm-hmm. a pot covered, and there's your tomato sauce. So tomato sauce is like a lot easier to make than... You can make a great tomato sauce with three ingredients. You're not putting really garlic in easily. this motherfucker? You can if you want, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Or basil? You can. You certainly can. How about oregano? Re- reg- <laughs> <laughs> I don't like oregano. You don't like oregano? I don't really no. like it very much either. It's too strong. Yeah, mm-hmm. it has a... Sometimes it'll ruin a pizza. If yeah. they yeah. put too much oregano in a pizza yeah, sauce, for it's sure. disgusting. To yeah. Disgusting. It's That's really what all wrong. the... Uh, I'm glad... Because I f- sometimes I feel like I'm the only person who <laughs> no. feels that way. Mm-hmm. No, no, yeah. no, no, no. Well, you know I'm Italian. Yeah. Are you? One... <laughs> or I'm 17 and a half percent Italian. <laughs> yeah. Which I always thought... When I was growing up, I thought it was half Italian. Turns out... Sure. Not that mm-hmm. much so much Italian. <laughs> Um, That's what all the house of pizza places in New England do, though. They put like a shit ton of oregano in the sauce. That pizza is fucking disgusting. I still like the pizza, pizza I grew up on. Is it's disgusting, all like the Greeks, like the Greek dude. guys. Had, they own like house of pizza. Last week England. I had uh, uh, Sally's in New Haven. Oh yeah, that is that? so good. Yeah, man. that is the only good pizza I think in New it's, England. It's like New Haven. Yeah. Well, yeah, it's in Connecticut. It's barely New England. Yeah, you guys have some. Fu- it's the, what do you? It's barely New England. It's the best part of New England. <laughs> Connecticut, you said Connecticut's the best part of New England. Yes, mm-hmm. dude. You, that's crazy, man. Yeah, that is a psychotic. Connecticut is the worst say. state yeah. out of all fifty. Okay, yeah. well, let's go through it. Pizza, ESPN, WWE. So, mm. so that's the big three. That's the, why you go the there. Freedom Trail, close to New York City. <laughs> <laughs> the Red Sox. Fuck the Red Sox. I tried to. I was selling my clothes earlier, and I heard the lady behind the counter say, "Ew, don't buy any Red Sox merch." Good. What the hell is that? Fuck the fucking It'll still Red sell. Fuck Some em. guy named Bill wants a hat with his initial on you it. You come back into the store, forget that you sold it to them, <laughs> <laughs> buy it back and double the price. <laughs> yeah, that was an oh, idiot oh, this is exactly my size. This Go Sox. Oh, stand. Clearing out the Red Sox. Oh, I got a white I have to half all the Red Sox merch. Walk into the thrift store. Oh, shit. <laughs> Look at this blue I'm not, I never find this in New York. Oh, oh my God. God. That's crazy. What an amazing gym. Yeah. No, that's a disgusting baseball team. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, you don't watch baseball. No, nah, I'd stopped in 04 when they won, won the World Series. You stopped watching baseball when you were seven years old? Yeah. What, I mean, <laughs> that's what, your story? What, what else is going to happen? They, they, it's like there's like... It did get so much less yeah. interesting after that. Because it's like yeah. years. It's like you, you get told when you're like... It's a like 100 kid. years, right? Yeah, 100 years since yeah. like they won yeah. a World Series. Reverse it's their the first, curse. like, mm. yeah, the, the big World Series win, and then like they and win again. again. Like, oh. It's like, all right. Okay. <laughs> Can't yeah, beat I do. I do. I do distinctly. And what year was Jackie this Robinson? The, like the twenties, two thousand three, two thousand three. I think he was still. <laughs> he was some still shit. I don't really know that much about <laughs> yeah. history. Yeah. Uh, no, it was, yeah, it was the fifties, forties. I don't think it was the twenties, yeah. was it? No, it was like the forties. I think it was the forties. Maybe the forties. Like that's 40, when because yeah. it was still okay. the Brooklyn Dodgers. Yeah, yeah like forty eight. That's my guess. Nineteen forty eight. Something like that. But they had this guy in the 04 Red Sox. He was like. 
legacy Is player. Is that Kurt like, Schilling year? Yeah, that was the Kurt Schilling Bloody Sock mm. year. But they had this guy, Ellis Burks, who was like 50-something, and they just had him on the team just so it was like... Like, he didn't do shit, but he was just on the team just to be there, and he just got a ring and then just fucking left. That's what baseball... That's, that's what you why should do. it's such a great sport, is that every single team has a big old fat guy yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. whose entire job is to walk out and get hit by the ball. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and then that he, was pretty much what he did. I think he was a DH. And it's every every team that's their favorite player yeah. of every fan. People are but he was like, like oh. the uh, the secondary, or the second DH, Other like, it was like David Ortiz was like the DH, and then he was like the second guy. I think so. He was correct. nice with the bat. Yeah. Is that the only sport where you can be fat? Yeah. And play Fo- Bartolo. Fo- football, Colon, you can be pretty football, fat. Yeah. Bartolo's a man. Yeah. He's a big. He's boy. a fucking man. Yeah. He's you got to be tall to play football, right? Yeah. Yeah. You, you can, can be tall be... and fat, but you can't be short and fat. I think. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. Can't be and you like have to be like strong two. too. Yeah. Like in baseball, <laughs> you don't really have to be anything. I yeah. don't know how a lot of these guys got into the league. Have long hair. Yeah. 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 I was reading this thing the other day that. Apparently, every baseball mascot exists because they would keep a disabled person in the dugout for good luck. <laughs> that what? was like, yeah, that was like a whole thing. Like, there's a good chunk. I think there was like a a guy on the Mets who was like like slow, and he like was like, I went to a fortune teller. They told That's me where the Philly fanatic be... comes from. <laughs> yeah, he actually looked like that. <laughs> he looked like that. And all the Irish ones. They, I think the Yankees kept like a dude with a like a hunchback in the dugout, and they would okay. like rub his hunch for yeah. good luck. That's well, before like, they invented costumes. That's yeah. that, baseball is so <laughs> yeah, exactly. great. It's, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's so awesome that baseball is like the only major sport that does have full superstitions. Yeah. Like, there's not, like, witchcraft-level voodoo stuff is, like, what baseball players believe in. Yeah. I think they Mickey Mantle would make the guy sleep under his bed for good luck on the road. <laughs> really? yeah. It's fucking awesome. <laughs> like, every... That, there should be You way... have to sleep under my hotel bed. I don't like... I don't like the whole, like, like uh, the optimization stuff that goes on in sports. That really yeah. turns me off where, like, uh, uh, what's his name? Um... Uh, Tom Brady is like, oh yeah, spending two million dollars a year to on eat like eating a, gel. Yeah, he's yeah. doing the like the the guy's reversing his aging. He's doing like that type of diet. <laughs> yeah, and, like, Where, like baseball, it's like I have to keep like. I have to keep this piece of wood in my leg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have or to, else I won't. I have hit. to keep all my baby teeth in my pocket. Yeah. to make sure <laughs> yeah. I can throw. Or I'm not gonna throw a fucking. And then they slider. throw a no hitter one time, and yeah. they're like, it was the teeth. <laughs> exactly. Know? Yeah. And not their hard work. No. Which yeah. is what I believe. They can never just let their hard work speak for itself. No. They, they never give hard. themselves a break. No. I know, man. Well, it's they do. Up. They funny also, podcasting was like that. The, the you got to eat like four hard-boiled eggs. <laughs> yeah. 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 I, I, yeah. I, 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 I would say I think we fully very, do it like that. Yeah. 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 I would say I have changed my pre-podcasting regimen so many times, and it is fully su- superstitious. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we have I a, would agree. That we have a one big rule. We have mm-hmm. a bunch of different different curses, I our, think. Our yeah. biggest rule is that we you cannot... Yeah. Under any circumstances, eat fried chicken uh-huh. within six hours of recording. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. If you do that, it we just you don't record. Brain. It gives you yeah. chicken bread. We yeah. have skipped My super, multiple I also, think, I also think if you have to if you have to pee really bad the entire episode, it makes it better. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If oh, you okay. are cold the entire episode, it makes it better. Yep. yep. If you don't start the episode hungry, but you start getting really hungry halfway yep. through, better. that's good. Mm-hmm. Yep. You can't All, eat a big yeah. meal. There's, a, there's right something before. that happens in your brain that makes you way, you have way to, better. I, yeah, I time out what time I eat, so I start to get hungry towards yeah. the end of the episode. Of course. Yeah. yeah, it makes it better. That's not having to pee is like that's valid though I think because it's like you're like let's get this over with yeah let's yeah. get the laughs in you're running I, through yeah, the, yeah, yeah. I feel yeah. like that all, it's all this kind of the same stuff with stand up I feel where yeah. you're like I don't know are you superstitious about doing stand up do you I have give anything my, like my that? toddler a gun with one <laughs> bullet in it and just let him walk around the room so you have to run that home makes the episode cool. bad. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's good uh, yeah. maybe having a dog that's another kind of loaded around. gun yeah. situation that you uh-huh. brought over here uh-huh. so that's nice that's I would think this would be bad luck though having a dog having to worry about your dog yeah well yeah. Yeah, but you have again. It gave us something to talk about. It's the mm-hmm. the dog is uh, barking. A lot of people actually like barking. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> it's especially when it's quiet people, in the yeah. background. Yeah, uh-huh. people like a this faint sucks. Bark. <laughs> <laughs> <The barking stops. laughs> a lot of people probably are j- there's going to be wrote an, a negative review. There's going to be a compilation <laughs> on YouTube. All barking moments. Mike Racine podcast. Yeah. Yeah. You know what people <laughs> like even more than barking is the the other compilation that comes out is people the podcasters reacting to the barks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. of what the what. 
Oh, oh like, hey. <laughs> Mike, Mike Racine's family ruins the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> it's four hours long. Yes. <laughs> Longer than the episode. <laughs> Honey, where's the spatula? <laughs> Do you guys record at your house? No. We oh. used to, but oh. we're in the studio. Now. Yeah, recording at the house was... Uh, See, that's another Those, curse. That's, yeah. a, that's a curse. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the house I think recording. That, I think that you have to go to a different location yeah. mm-hmm. where okay. you can... Um, you got to treat it like a, like a job. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. he had or a like gas leak in his house. Yeah. Okay. Like we were trapped. doing this, like we were doing the show while he had like gas pumping into his apartment. Yeah, for about a year okay. and a half. Yeah, at a, at a major described to me as a major gas leak. In yeah, my, in my home. <laughs> okay. yeah. We were and, just sitting uh, there, just like what fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Probably some of the best work. Yeah, yeah. 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 made yeah. it completely brain dead. And, and you'll never find the exact right amount of gas exactly. needs to be no, in the apartment never, to make the yeah. show good. Yeah. No, yeah. I wrote. I wrote actually in one time. I used to also smoke a lot of weed at the time, mm. and I would write ideas for movies in my phone. Mm. And one time I wrote, I, I wrote down in my phone. Before I even knew there was a gas leak, I wrote down guy who who knows he has a gas leak but keeps but doesn't do anything about it because he likes it. <laughs> <laughs> and I realized that was a movie about me that I Yeah, it's idea. your real life. Yeah. 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 Is because I actually quite liked having a gas leak. And then once you uh. get the I just had another scare with lead paint in my in my vintage uh, China. Okay. Yeah, because this is another situation that's going on. But the, I like the feeling of discovering something like this mm-hmm. and being like, "Oh, this is you why everything. everything this yeah. is why this happened, and this happened, and this happened." And you're like, "I survived." Yeah, yeah. and yeah. I yeah. am at zero fault. It's not because I didn't yeah. work hard like, enough. Okay, right. time to be okay. Starting right. out, time to be normal. Yeah, yeah. 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 Back on Getting the couch. So disappointed for the next week. Yeah. Yeah. It does yeah. feel like you're sucks. uncovering a conspiracy too, because you're like, "Oh my god." <laughs> That's yeah. it. Yeah, <laughs> this has been it all along. It's the lead paint in the <laughs> in the plate. Yeah, turns out I'm just not very good at anything. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's just, like every time you eat macaroni and cheese, the the doll's face on your plate gets lighter and lighter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, what's, what's happening? <laughs> yeah, I kind of a message like, from God. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was like uh, she just changes race every time. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the different types of food, yeah. <laughs> the different meals. Yeah. Oh my God, she's Mexican today. This is yeah. crazy. It's just all the layers of, of lead paint stripping off from like they start, they just kept painting over me like, no, I don't, this isn't acceptable. <laughs> <anymore."> <laughs> it, gets, it gets lighter and lighter as time went on with yeah. more lead paint every single time. But that's why I love to eat hot dogs from the gas station because mm-hmm. you eat them and you survive. And you yeah. go, yes. that's right. Yes. Yeah. I'm strong as hell. Yeah. 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 But then one in every four, you do actually get quite yeah. sick. You get that crazy green diarrhea. I've gotten gas so provides. sick from gas well, station food before. Oh, really? Yeah, the tuna salad. That's because I go for tuna salad. <laughs> oh, well, that's your own fault. Yeah. I don't know what is wrong with me. Yeah, yeah you got to get the rollers, salad, And then I throw away the package, and then I realize that it probably had an expiration date I could have yeah. read before uh, I bought it, mm-hmm. but it's already in the trash, so mm-hmm. yeah. I'm not going to try to hold my tuna salad above my head and dig through trash to find it. So right. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. You got muscles from the gas station. Amazing. <laughs> 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 yeah. Muscles marinara. <laughs> Clams <laughs> Casino from 7-Eleven. <laughs> Yeah, uh, pretty good idea. I yeah. think marinara is like the worst thing. Like any kind of tomato sauce is you the worst. Up. Is Don't no, no, no. From like thing. a fast food place. Because uh, when I was like five mm. years old, I got that was the first time I've ever had food poisoning. I got the Burger King chicken parm sandwich. Oh yeah, <laughs> and oh, that dude, was good. I I got up for school the next day and just both ends just like a fountain, just like you got shooting. food poisoning from yeah the chicken sa- Damn. from the marinara. You think it was a marinara? That's good that it happened before school, though. Yeah, I know. Because yeah. I one time before school, I ate like six Entenmann's donut holes. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I probably had more than six. If that's, I yeah, I was going to say, that's, right. not, that's not a crazy yeah. amount. Yeah. And I just like sat in study hall and I couldn't, and I, I was, this was at a point where I didn't, I didn't poop in school, mm-hmm. but I just sat in study hall and I couldn't stop farting. Oh. But then oh I once God. I started, I was like, I can't get up because if I get up, they're going to know it's me. Mm. So I just had to like sit there and keep farting. <laughs> <laughs> and I, had a bunch, I was a sophomore. I had all these seniors in my study hall that, and I just hear people be like, what the fuck? It's so I have had it was right after 9-11. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I, was, <laughs> I, was, I thought it was a terrorist attack. <laughs> and I, I remember this one girl gets up and she she gets up and she closes the window. <laughs> That's what? not what you do when it's when the room smells like shit, you don't like bitch. it. <laughs> yeah. She uh, thought that, off, she thought that the smell was coming in from the outside. <laughs> so it's farting outside yeah. the window. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Some girl oh, walking home, like walking home from work. Yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> oh, what's happening outside that window, huh? <laughs> Nobody. That means that your that means that your farts were smelling so industrial. That yeah. Yeah. this can't be a human. Oh yeah, this right. must be the septic drug. <laughs> yeah. the yeah. There's no <laughs> possible way this came from a human body that, yeah. that is inside. It has to be an yeah. environmental. That's, yeah, that's yeah. so crazy. I think it was coming from outside. Is insane. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and there was just there was this white trash kid next to me who was like asleep the whole study hall, and I was like, they probably think it's him. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Perfect crime. Did you yeah. ever blame it? You never went like, oh my god, this sleeping guy's farting. No. No. no, but I did shit my pants in kindergarten once, mm. and it was the same kind of situation. Yeah, everybody being like, "Oh, what? Oh, it smells so bad." And I'm mm-hmm. like, "Yeah, I know." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there's a there's a picture of me when when me I have a brother who's like a year younger than me, and uh, there's a picture of me and him in a bathtub, and I took a shit in the bathtub, <laughs> and then I blamed it on him, and he's yeah. like bawling, crying. There's a shit between us. Your mom's like, "I better get the pole." I, yeah. my, I think my dad was like, "This is too awesome." He took a photo of us. And I'm like smiling, and my brother's crying so hard. And your, your little brother? My little brother, yeah. And they they thought uh, they thought that he made a shit in the toilet, but it was or in the bath, but it was my ass, man. Having a little brother is pretty great. Yeah, it was really awesome. Yeah, yeah. You get away with a lot. You just get to torture somebody. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You just get to ruin their life, mm-hmm. uh, which is really a nice experiment because yeah. you get to yeah. grow up and decide if you liked it or not. Yeah, and then you right. can become a good person. And yeah. Basically, nothing ever happened with right. your brother. Yeah, yeah. I remember my, my little brother being like, "You're always making fun of me." <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know. Yeah, they they do that. You know. Yeah. See, but my older brother, I was always like, he, I, I I thought I was like a celebrity with his friends. You know, but uh, it turns out when I got older, they were making, making fun, fun of me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, <they were> Whoa, <laughs> here's Kate. Cool Kate. <laughs> <Kayla. laughs> for us, <laughs> Basically, what another was. fashion show for us. <laughs> 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 that litter, there are. You just keep I'm going not, down to the basement <laughs> periodically. <laughs> there are. And look at this jacket. <laughs> <laughs> look at this Looney Tunes jacket. Very cool. <laughs> oh, Caleb, you're so cool. <laughs> you're awesome. Caleb, you're so popular on MySpace. We've been posting photos of you. Yeah, there is probably a hundred photos of me in a dress because me and my brothers, which I got, I mean, at least. They thought it was funny cool for me Caleb. to be to wear yeah. my mom's clothes <laughs> and be like, oh, look at me. I'm a dude. <laughs> I found out later. Yeah, they're making fun of me. Bastards. Yeah. Uh, all right, Mike. So where can people find your special? It comes out this week, right? Yeah, it'll be out uh, Thursday, March 21st. Okay, the day after. Oh, yeah, the day out. after. Yeah, cool. Yeah, so that's perfect timing. Yeah. Yeah. And what are we trying to hit in terms of views so that people can kind reload of adjust, the like page? Like if they see yeah. and it's at the view count, they can just close it. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'm probably going to get demonetized because I say some curse words in it. Oh, uh, okay. So I, I, I can't recommend, I'll be I can't like, endorse it then. I'm sorry. Yeah, well, you know, I say, f- <laughs> <laughs> you know, I say fuck. We're going to delete all oh, this. come on. <laughs> I say fuck, pussy. Oh, um, in the same sentence? On YouTube, uh, man? Uh, you know, like here and the, like okay. here and there. Yeah. All right. Well, that's fine. I say uh, and some other f- tune in to find out what other curse words <laughs> I say. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so check it out for all the cursing people. I won't mm-hmm. be watching it because of the cussing, but if you yeah. like cussing, go check out my yeah. cursing special. It's called what? Um, it's called uh, I'm Normal. That's a perfect name. And there's that a lot of a fucking name. cursing in it. Yeah. Um, far from normal to me. But yeah. But if you could watch it, I'd really appreciate go it. Go check out Mike. He's one of mm-hmm. the funniest comics. Oh, yeah. I will say in the world. Yeah. In I'll say galaxy. in the world, in the, in the whole galaxy. entire galaxy. Uh, Mike is always a, a somebody I stick around for at shows. Thanks. Frankly, yeah, uh, I like skipping a lot of people's sets <laughs> and then yeah. in the bathroom, <laughs> and then I'll come out and watch you. Yeah, I don't have any new stuff though, really. What do you mean? Uh, it's hard to like write material, develop new material. Oh, it's so you've probably seen everything that I'm that I'm doing. But if you haven't seen this this hour that I taped a year ago, I would love you to watch it and. You know, I'll be watching it. Just mm-hmm. watch it. We all Are will. you doing a YouTube yeah. premiere? My wife's in it. I I guess what is that though? You like you like premiere? You sit you sit there and you got to watch it with people? Yeah, they have yeah. like a chat that pops up. I mean, up. you don't have to watch it. I don't it. really you don't have to watch it. You, you made can it. go do whatever yeah. you want. Yeah. You, can, you, just, just leave you don't it have on. to do it all yeah. again live. It just means yeah. it like all gets <laughs> yeah. it gets it it acts like a live stream Yeah, yeah. Stream. They have a live chat that you can I mean, you could you could sit there and just like type like wait wait for this punchline. Oh, this one's good. This one's really good. Y'all laughing? <laughs> yeah, so you like it? I did put my Venmo in the middle of the special. No. <laughs> because I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, you know. Yeah, you got to make yeah. money on it. You got to make money. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Thank you, Mike. So if you like it, you can Venmo me $5. Mm-hmm. Okay. You know, Perfect. Venmo Mike. Say your Venmo right but now. But if you like it, what <laughs> you like this episode? <laughs> yeah, that works too. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. for us guys, uh, it's less than a week from our first show tour. Oh, so yeah. come out if you want to buy one of these shirts. Oh, yeah. We got Mike in one of the shirts. They will not too. be online. 
ever. That's yeah. my promise that I'll never break. Okay. I think he, he might. <laughs> oh, you just I'm sell a, them? But I'm a oh, liar. That's, that's cool, though. <laughs> so, but come to the show to buy the shirt yeah. if you want it. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of sus to sell T-shirts on the internet. Yeah. But it's annoying. Yeah, your little it's online very store. Annoying. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's so much easier know. to just do it at, in person. To do a cash business. Yeah. Like, yep. like we're... Like like we used to do. Like we mm-hmm. used to exactly. do. Like, like, like websites used to be. And please yeah. bring cash to buy the t-shirts. Yeah. yeah. Because we'll, we'll take Venmo, but please bring, Just bring cash. cash. Just bring <laughs> cash. Yeah. yeah. So we can hide it. Yeah. Yeah. In our mattresses. All yeah. right. Thank you, Mike. Yeah, thank you. Thanks, guys. Bye. Oh, great. <laughs> My oh, body great. moving back and forth sounds like this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My body. Just your body, just yeah, have like extra liquid. It's just my body, it's idiot. My body. It's honestly my body. fucked up to judge you for having your body make what was noise. My was body that again? does make this noise when I move around. Yeah, that means that you have a excess a liquid in your belly. <laughs> Wait, did you hear it? I didn't hear it, but he's doing this. Yeah, I'm trying to shake he's my belly. He's trying to shake his belly. I can do this. I can like. Wait, oh, wait, wait, you wait, can, you wait, can fully wait, hear it. Wait, it. Stop, stop, stop. I, I know that my body does this. Listen, listen. Oh, my God. <laughs> can you do that thing where you roll your belly? It's so faint. I wonder if people at home What do you mean? But I, I, if I drank a lot of water right now. Hold on, I can do it. I think. You, do like you can, are you belly dance? Whoa. I never understood. Why is it belly dancing? Well, I just got the answer, actually. Why is it, like, <laughs> sexual? I don't know. <laughs> I think it's because it it's includes other parts of the belly? body. The belly Ew. to some cultures. So think about this. Let's take a step back. In American culture, we have the pussy and the asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Correct. The line between these two points of interest is known as the taint. Mm-hmm. The taint of mis- uh, The taint or the, uh, the perineum. Right, 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 right. This is seen as probably the most sexual, utterly attractive zone. Mm-hmm. On a woman the in American taint? culture, yes. It's so how does, the it's two best stuff. how does this now relate to other, belly dancing? Now in other cultures, they don't regard the asshole as really so nice. Mm-hmm. It's not a sexual. Men, it's not so sexual, and this is replaced by <clears throat> the breasts. Oh, so now mm. what is the zone, Patrick? What is the perineum of the breasts and the pussy? The belly. Wow. The belly. That's so a great belly point. dancing to a Middle Eastern culture is almost the same as when an American woman gets up and shakes around her taint. Oh! <laughs>